Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search gemstone to see our gemstone enhancement chart. this beautiful face going wait I'm standing next to the one the only Sarah Davies is here why did I think there was going to be some sort of audio for you Sarah um you really I mean look wait a minute I need an explanation on that last photo. oh I, I, well I do you know often, people yeah I just often nip down to the palace and hang out with Wills and Kate and their grandma no no I was really lucky in oh that I, I won a really big award over in the UK uh, two years ago now and uh, I was awarded as a member of the British Empire so I got invited down to the palace with the family. I was um, I was eight and a half months pregnant. Wow. As you could see, I hadn't eaten too many you, pies. Um, but it was the most wonderful oh, day. Oh, congratulations. And it, we were basically rewarded, or I was rewarded for everything we do in the UK. So the products that we develop, the export that we do, uh, the employment that we create. So it was really great that um, someone really special uh, thought, saw fit to come thank me for that. So that was wonderful. Well, then doesn't that just mean what an honor it is to have this uh, beautiful <laughs> woman here. Be a part of our show. If you love Sarah and everything she brings to HSN, our testimonial line is open. We are live. Please I'm your host, call. Valerie Stepp. Yeah, yeah, we would love to we hear would from love you. To hear from Absolutely. People. Okay. Um, the first item we're going to talk about is brand new, oh, right? Yes. So this is brand new, and this is also the only airing of this. So last and final airing yep. of your Crafters Companion Cherry Blossom stamp and die set. I want this. I know, but the oh, thing cute. is, you look at that and you think, what is it? Come okay. and look at this. <laughs> this is next level stamping and die cutting. So can you see, beautiful cherry blossom, but each one of these cherry blossoms actually is dimensional and die cuts and lifts up from the card. And then if you look exactly the same, I mean, who wouldn't be absolutely enamored to be able to make these sort of cards? You've then got the corner where you stamp the corner, die cut it, and all the pieces lift forward. I'm gonna show you this as part of my demonstration. Now, whether you're going for the big focal points, this is one of the extra stamps and die sets that we've got. There is not many of them, mind, I will warn you. Um, and then the, even the cherry blossom, can you see? It's, it's all about having this dimension. Now, I wanted you to see what you could make before I went into hitting you too much with what it is that you're getting. Because I think once you see that, you become totally inspired. You're, you're probably watching thinking, I can't possibly do this. Wait till you watch me do it live and you will absolutely believe that you can. You know, I think that's the thing is there is some intimidation factor, but that's why we love to bring in the professionals, the experts, to show you how simple it really is. So whether you're new or you're, you know, a professional, this is an invitation for you to be a part of our show. So cherry blossoms. Right, let's start with the cherry blossoms. Because okay. I know this is the one that you're all loving based on the feedback on Facebook. So two stamps and then the die set. So okay. if I start with the stamp, I've just loaded the stamp onto an acrylic block and I'm going to ink this up and we're going to start off by inking just in a bit of brown. Let's put that tree stump in, all right? So there's our, oh, I missed an inking bit in the middle, but you get the idea. Then let's put the actual cherry blossoms on. Mm -hmm. So now I just put the other stamp on. And again, we've got some nice, uh, a nice, bright, vibrant design. And then we're going to stamp this over top of our tree. So we now have a tree with cherry blossoms on. In seconds. Then... Oh, this is when it gets brilliant, though. Okay. This is the die. Now, the die doesn't actually cut anything out like you usually expect with dies. What it does is it lines up exactly over top. And you see, it's going to line up perfectly over top of that cherry blossom. Uh -huh. And then I'm going to pop that through my die cutting machine. Now, I'm lucky enough to have a Gemini. But if you aren't someone who's lucky enough to have a Gemini, then these will work with every other different brand of machines. However, the good news for you is today, we've got them in stock. I think they're Finally the lowest price we've ever done. Lowest price we've yeah. ever, ever had it on air. Which is a ever. perfect opportunity. Anywhere. Anywhere. Lowest price we've had it on air 
anywhere in the world. Which means it's a challenge. You can look that up, but that is available. You can talk to your representative or we might be able to find you um, an item number. And there it is, the, the item number popping up right there, the 614216. That is the Companion Gemini, um, the die cutter and embosser bundle. And I will just tell you, so it comes with what we call full size plates. So it comes with plates that are this size. Oh, wow. However, I'm using these little shorty ones that are the Gemini Junior accessory plates uh, so that I can die cut and pass in eight seconds, right? So that's the, uh, the only reason I'm doing that. Now, can you see, after all I'm oh doing gosh. is popping these up. This is what we talk about, Barry, when we're talking about getting that dimension on the wow. card. Now, if I cut to one that I've already done, all I've done here is actually glittered it. Oh. So can you see, it's exactly the same thing now. All this is is totally glittered. So each one of these then still pops up. And I think this is what people love about Chloe's dyes and Samsung. Chloe is a designer that we work with in the UK, really talented designer. And she's just got a nice, bright kind of that really vibrant, trendy, as we would say, Pinterest, Pinterest and Instagrammable yes. type Pinterest of look worthy. and feel to it. Yes. So can you see that will just go mount onto the front of a card, and then all you need oh to do gosh. is add a bit of a sentiment onto here, and you could add. Um, let's have a look. I've got a lovely little bit of ribbon that we can put on here, just to kind of finish it off. But cards like that literally take minutes to make when you've got the components. Now. The oh, cherry nice. blossom is just the first one. Remember, that $24.95 price, I personally would be happy to pay that just to do the cherry blossom. Mm -hmm. But you get the cherry blossom, you also get the, the large pieces. So if I just find a card where these have been used, look at those beautiful large pieces. Oh, so, so you're and getting the, benefit the, here, the blossoms, the flowers Three different sizes well. that you can place anywhere on your card. So you get the die, and the die cuts into the stamp. You even get that little extra stamp plate that goes with it. Uh -huh. And then the third one is this corner. So I think you, I think you're sensing the value now. Absolutely, when you you're getting see all the value in three that. of them. I didn't realize you guys. I, I thought it was see, like you said. Yourself. I thought it was just for the cherry blossoms. You, I thought it was good. You would be <laughs> you you would be forgiven for thinking that. <laughs> so can you see there? You've got the the extra archway one. It makes beautiful corners. That's lovely for making reeds. So you get all three of those now. Those of you who really love this look mm -hmm. and Chloe's effect, we've got some extras, okay? okay? So if I just show you the extras that we do have, there is a set of three extra stamps, which are just for having all the finishing section sentiments. So if you want to finish that off, those are the extra stamps that you would use. Now, a lot of the cards that we're using here are all stamped and embossed. So what I have done for you is made you a set of embossing powders. So you've got three embossing powders and also the watermark ink pad so that you can stamp and emboss with any of these designs. Perfect. And okay. then the extra set oh, of the border. And there's more. So lots of great things you can add on to your order. We've got several colors on the line waiting for us. Let's, oh, let's go out fab. to our backyard here in Florida and say wow. hi to Nancy. Nancy, hi, I'm Valerie, and I'd love to introduce you to Sarah Davies. Hey, Nancy. Hi, Sarah. How are you? I am excellent. I am bright and breezy. You wouldn't think I'd only had two hours sleep, would you not? Oh, never. <laughs> I had 12, and I still looked <laughs> like this. You mean, Nancy, you didn't stay up till 2 o'clock to watch me. I'm no, disappointed. Darling, not this time. But <laughs> usually, I have so many of your products, and as soon as I hang up, I'm getting the, the cherry blossom. Oh, this is... Nancy, have you have you had any of other Chloe's stamps and dyes that we've brought Everything. before? Everything. <laughs> I mean, I can't even tell you. I'm getting your box kits. I have so many of Fabulous. your stamps. I have your Gemini. I have everything I can think that you make. Brilliant. But well, to me, that well is testimonial alone to our products. If you literally are getting everything as they're coming out. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I don't think, I don't know of any that I don't have. <laughs> I'm honestly trying to think. Everything, I even found your, oh, I don't know if I can say, I found your website, but anyways. Yep. I, my Christmas cards are on the uh, manger. Oh, oh, fabulous. They are so beautiful. And then I'm putting them on a plate. Oh, uh, wow. My Christmas cards this year is your manger scene on a dinner plate. Oh, wow, I, I love that you are so organized, Nancy, that you're thinking about Nancy, Christmas already. I, I'm going to give you my address so you can send me one of those manger cards because that sounds pretty <laughs> spectacular. You if know what? You, if you do, if I can get it, I will because they are oh. absolutely 
absolutely beautiful. Your voice is so special, Nancy, and we're so delighted. You know, we have an entire hour with Sarah. Oh, and so it's just going to get better and better. Miss a minute. Okay, good. So we want you to stay there. Do I need to send you back to uh, the... We're going to send you back just so you can order the cherry blossoms. All right, Perfect. so we sent Nancy back because we don't want her to miss out. We're limited quantities on this. And everything you always bring to us there always sells out so quickly. Just and this is brand new. We had, we had one of Chloe's sets on um, at midnight. And I think when I checked this morning, there was about 80 of them oh, there. Goodness. I mean, literally, every time we bring these, they sell out. Now, you've watched me doing this live while I was on the phone there to Nancy. Can you see, Valerie, how each one of these, I'm going to get my little porky tail so you can see. It's actually a two-part... <gasps> Are you right? serious? So each one of these pops up and then the extra bit pops up from the inside. I mean, these are these are not just ordinary things. These are absolutely spectacular. Now, I've just been told we have to start wrapping up. So if I just quickly <laughs> cut to the one that I'd already glittered, you can see how making an edge piece down a card like that looks stunning. And then actually you don't need to do an awful lot to that card to make it look really spectacular. Now that's one of the extra pieces, but remember you're getting three main, the, not just the cherry blossom, the price on your screen, you'd right. think it was just the cherry blossom. Cherry blossom, But you also florals, get the big florals and the beautiful borders. And the beautiful, and the beautiful uh, flower spray. Um, now, it's on a birthday price, but if you'd like to pay nothing for it, how nothing? about opening up, yes, how about opening up a HSN credit card? Once you do and get approved, we're gonna give you a coupon for up to $25 off your first single item purchase. And you can use that towards any of your crafting needs today. We're also doing a special offer um, for those of you that are getting lots of different crafting items. $5 flat rate to ship all of your crafts and all of your sewing needs today. So it's a really exciting way. If you didn't know, um, we're also doing five flexible payments on everything that you're seeing today. So that means that that wonderful little set that we just lo looked at was $4.99. Guys, it's our birthday. So HSN is turning 41 and we couldn't think of a better way to celebrate with you at home then bringing you unbelievable brand new items things you've never seen before on unbelievable values including our next set so this is the crafters companions stencils and ink pads over a $40 retail value get it home on flex pay for less than five dollars okay this is going to be huge. It's going to blow my mind. Like, I know this is. There's two really big launches here. Okay. There are the stencils, which is what I'm going to focus on, but there are our brand new oh, this Harmony is a world launch. ink pads. <gasps> Worldwide launch of the Spectrum Noir ink pads. So you got a little bit of a sneak preview if you stayed up with me till 2 a.m. But these are water-based, water-reactive dye ink pads. So they're all about blending. And I'm, I'm just going to say... Treat yourself to one set, okay. get them home. You will find they perform unlike any other ink pad that you have ever worked with. These have been in the making for over two years to get the formulation exactly how we want them, to do all of the crafting techniques that you're going to be watching me do now for years and years to come. Years years to come. When you start with these, you just build up your collection. So you just have a choice of color. <clears throat> so of which set you want, either the summer yellows, the dreamy blues, or the fiery reds. Those are your choices, or you can get all three if you want. <laughs> now, in the set, I'm just going to show you a little bit about what you're going to be able to make. So you're getting a three part layering stencil and I'm going to show you how they work but these are the effects that you're going to create now I started mixing and matching other different colors in here how realistic do these look do these fuchsias look how incredible is it just in one color now can you see them there are three shades of pink in there that's the three shades of pink that would come if you got the pink ink pads Look at these. That's beautiful. It looks real. These, these stencils, I just want to show you a it few looks like samples. I smell it. And then I'm going to go in and show you how it all works, okay? Now, you might have seen some of our three-part layering stencils before. I've done some larger ones for home decor. This is the first time we've developed some for card making. So, I'll show you exactly how they work, right? In each set, you actually get two component sets of stencils. And then once we move into the stencils, each stencil has three stencils in it. And you can see they get more and more intricate and advanced as they move on. So there's the three ones in the hydrangea. Now, here's how it works. You start with number one. You know it's number one because it's got a one on it, right? So 
I'm going to work, I'm gonna work back to front, upside down for the camera. So I pop down number one, and then all I'm going to do is, in these little corners, I'm just going to put a little circle in where the circles are, and this is gonna show me what moves on. Now, okay. you get, with the hydrangea, you get the pack of three water-reactive dyes. Now, these are perfectly toned to give you that lovely ombre effect. Oh, can you just take the lid off? Oh, there we go. There we go. I thought I'd missed it. Right. You also get the applicator. Okay. So this is the applicator you'll have seen me using for ages now. It's the first time we brought it to you. Now, look how juicy these are. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to start up by building this. And look how easy it is to apply this ink into the stencil. Now, these colours, what you'll find is in each set, so, for example, in the hydrangea here, you're getting the blues, mm -hmm. um, but I've done a different colour with each set that we're doing. So those of you who are going to start on this collection with us now and build up your ink pads, you can get the blues in with this set. We haven't repeated the blues in with anything else. Okay. So if you're buying multiple sets today, you're not going to get multiple ink pads because you'll only buy the ink pad once. Okay. Now, we lift off number one. Put uh -huh. that down. Then I'm going to line up number two, ah. and I'm just going to line up those two little circles exactly where we had them, right? Then I come in for the second colour of ink, and I'm just now going to ink through with that second colour. Now, when we've put these sets together, no other ink pad manufacturer in the world has ever developed blending sets like this. This is the first time we've done it. And what we've done is we've followed through the story of what we've done with our Spectrum Noir. So you know, with Spectrum Noirs, you always get three colours to get that perfect blend. Mm -hmm. This is exactly what we've now done with the ink pads. So, can you that. see, we're now starting to get a bit of depth and dimension. Yes, absolutely. Then you come and add number three number over three. the top again. Uh -huh. So number three is going to go over holes. here now. Line up the... See, yep. you've got the hang of it already. I've got it, I'm ready. You've only been watching me for a few minutes and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in with the very darkest one so now this is something that's going to look like it's in the foreground now how easy was this to do honestly if you've never ever done any blending any work like this before these are the best ink pads you could possibly start with and anyone can do what you're watching me do here Valerie you don't need to be oh an expert crafter look to be that. able to do effects like this wow I, you, I am literally astonished and you can go from that I mean here's yeah. the one that I'd finished up so all I've done is added a little bit more splatter in the background and that becomes a phenomenal card. That is absolutely <clears throat> breathtaking. So, now you understand the yes. concept, come and let me walk you through the different options, okay. right? Okay. So, I know you're all going for the lilac one that we've just used now. Why would you do Now you've seen it. So, you not only do you get the lilac in this one, but can you see, if I just show you, you get the mm -hmm. two different flowers in each set. Okay. You also get the set of three ink pads. Now, to put this into perspective, the ink pads alone for the set of three would be 1995. Wow. So for an extra five dollars, if you were going to get the ink yep. pads, you You're get kidding. the two sets of stencils, and each stencil collection is a three pack because you've got the three different layers. Sure. And you get the sponge applicator. The sponge applicator too. So sponge too? applicator with extra little application bits, uh -huh, so you get the two extra applicators in. Little at the bottom. That's the first one. Mm -hmm. Then, if you want to go for the beautiful yellows, now you're going to do exactly the same again. So you're going to get the two different flowers of layering stencils, and you're going to get the three colours of the ink. And I'll show you all the ink colours in just a second, and then the, the applicator as well. And then, if you want to go for the oranges in, in this collection as well, again, you're getting the three beautiful orange shades. Look at the depth and dimension that you get in each one of these. I mean, that rose. And generally, you wouldn't actually just use one colour. Sure. You'd probably mix and match the colours. Okay, I take you back that, to them colours. Which is a great opportunity for you to pick up several of the sets. This one's called Fiery Reds. We've got the Dreamy Blues or the Summer Yellows. Those are what we just showed you just now. And you're getting, like you said, Sarah, you're getting all the stencils and yep. the sponges. So when you start and see the mixing, so this is a mm. monotone one, but then you'll see we move from a monotone to mixing with the greens in there. Then you've got, um, that's the same one again that we've got, then that's the same design in a completely different colour. And you see you've got the single rows and the three-part rows. You don't need to use them both together. It just gives you a bit of an idea of what you could be doing. Now, I will tell you, if you do love the ink pads, which I know this, I this do. was the I'm, big launch I'm of the ink pads. Already. If you start and build up the collection, okay. this is what it's all going to look like in the end. And I have organized mine in our new ink pad storage wow. trays. So we have the ink pad storage trays available. So if you pop on the website, they mm -hmm. come in a box like this, and basically you get half of half of this amount mm -hmm. in one box. They're not just to store our ink pads. If you have a look, let's have a look. I've got a couple of Tim Holtz Distress ones, so I could I could organize my oh, okay. uh, Tim Holtz ones in here if I wanted to. Um, you 
you can put things like your, I've got a, a brilliance one here. You've got a I've got say. a memento. I could, you could organize all your ring, but there will be people buying scores of these sets today. I mean, I and you. that's the thing is you want to stay organized and you can build on your collection so you can add this onto your order as well. Um, all of you are picking up the, what we've got for you today in either the summer yellows, the dreamy blues, or the fiery reds. Remember, you can add onto your you order the additional ink pads. Do you want me to just show you quickly all of I the colors I want you to show me as pads, much as you right? can, Sarah. So. <laughs> I really do. And I think I might be able, well, I don't know if I'll squeeze another demo, I'll show you the basics. Okay. So these are all the different shades, so you always get three in the collection, so you get that beautiful ombre. And I know I haven't had much time to do it justice, I'm coming up on Facebook at 20 past 10, okay. on the HSN webpage to do a full-blown tutorial oh. on how these ink pads okay, work. Okay, so mark your, mark your moments. 20 past 10, as soon as we finish, 10. I'll be going okay. through there. Here's all the different shades that we've got, and then you also have these. So there are 12 sets of three families in okay. there, okay? I love it. So, so, do you think I've got time to do another quick? Uh, no, um, I haven't. Got I've got I've got about 20 seconds. seconds. But let me just show, show you. Though. Let me show you again how it works. So, if you're working with the future, I future. Think you might have a moment, Sarah. Can I, can I, can we're gonna, I do it? We're, can gonna, I do we're it? just right. going to stretch just a moment because oh. we have lots of you. We have hundreds of you on the phone lines. Remember, this is brand new, world launch. You've never seen this before. So, layer one. Layer one. Put the little corners in, right? Yes. Then, if you get your ink pad, so this is the oranges. Uh -huh. So I've got my light, medium, and dark in here. So I'm going to start with the lightest one. You've got the applicator yep. included, You're getting right? Two sponges. And all you're doing is applying this. Okay. So you're starting, and can you see how how these blend beautifully together? And and I'm not getting any marks. This and is I love the, the saturation of them too. It's a beautiful, um, even finish, very which I vivid, love. Super vivid. So there is layer number one. Okay. Then you just peel off number one. And you can get your little nail on. on that. There you and go. then we're going to come on with layer number two. So this is that fuchsia. And I know you wouldn't usually have necessarily fuchsias in orange, but you're going to love this look. I think you'll understand why I've done it. So pick up the second one, rubbing it through, and we've designed each of these sets to always step up in shading. So it's not just for doing these stencils. You'll see I've got a show at nine o'clock tonight where I'm going to be showing you how you use these with stamping and creating ombre effects. Watch that Facebook Live. You'll see even more techniques coming up. Can you see we're starting to get that depth and oh, dimension? Oh, yeah. Definitely. Oh, we've got our producer now where you're going, oh, yes. <laughs> uh, it's really starting to come to life and then the third one because we're going in with that deeper one again i love that it's already pre-done like i don't have to think about what shades to use i don't have to think about what steps to do i mean there's it's completely goof proof you can color outside the lines yep. and you don't have to worry about it and then the beautiful. finished product is so spectacular it's as if you i mean we were in Sarah's mind look, and we knew that this that. i mean you guys <gasps> look now, at that that took me what a minute not even. A minute. I mean, that's crazy. The stencils, hold your hand, walk you through it. But once you get these ink pads, I'm showing you one of like 20 different techniques that you can do with these. Honestly, join me for that Facebook Live at 10 past, 20 past 10. But I'll show you even more. But stay with us here because Sarah and I are together this entire hour on the phone mm -hmm. lines for the fiery reds, the dreamy blues, the summer yellows. Less than $5 on FlexPay to get it home. All right, taking a quick little break. We're going to talk to you about our email sign up and then come back and shop with us some more right after this. Have you signed up for your HSN email? Sign up for HSN emails now to stay connected to our hottest deals of the week. You'll even receive exclusive coupons. Never miss a today's special. We'll send you the scoop on our best value of the day straight to your inbox. Head on over to hsn.com now and search email to sign up today. It's Project Central around here. With just a little imagination, some of this, a bit of that. The possibilities are endless. Whether you're just getting started or if you have a full room devoted to crafting, we have the supplies and ideas to help get it done. Say yes to crafting at HSN. Day. It's our birthday. We're celebrating. Sarah Davies is here. We're celebrating with you. Um, we are live. This is my last probably like 35 minutes and I get to hang out with this gorgeous gal. You'll be We're ready for a lie down by the time I'm finished with you. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, listen. Yeah, it, it takes a toll on the hosts. It does, Honestly, it does, me, it me, does. Me and my little bundle of excitement for a whole hour is a lot to cope with. I know, but you know what though? <laughs> Everything that we're doing, I feel is very therapeutic. And, and, what, and the next item that we're gonna talk about might be one of my most personal favorite things I because I be. don't really have yeah. very good handwriting, but I love the sentiment of being able to hand write something to someone. Look at so these. if you want to really look like a professional, Crafters Companion and Spectrum Noir has done the art liner bundle. Nearly a $60 value today on five flexible payments. Less than $8.99 to truly transform anyone's handwriting into these beautiful, almost almost like calligraphy. I mean, these the highs and the lows, the depths of this is so stunning. Do you know, this is a, is a trend that has been coming through now for close to two years and is showing no signs of slowing down. You see it all over the high street, all over Instagram and Pinterest. This is the look that everyone's trying to achieve but in all honesty, it ain't that easy. No, it's not. It's, if you're just starting from scratch and doing it yourself, it's not that easy to have. What you need is, you need education and understanding, and you also need the right products. Mm -hmm. So just because right a tools. pen has a brush nib doesn't mean it's a specialist one to do no. this sort of technique. What we've done is we've developed these pens. We sell millions of Spectrum Noir pens every year. We're known for them all over sure. the world. We've developed these pens specifically for brush lettering. Okay. So if you look at the little nib on it, it, it doesn't look like much here. However, as I start writing with this, I'll move this out of the way, you see we can go um, up with very fine strokes or we can come down with very heavy strokes, up with very light strokes, down with very heavy strokes. And that is what gives you the, the effect of being able to do this. Uh -huh. Now, what you've got in the kit is a whole collection. Look at the six, um, the eight colors that we've got in here. So you've got some really on-trend colors. So many people just brush letter in black. Black is so dull. Let's have a bit of color and a bit of spice in our life. Let's, wow, you know, some so of these 2017, colors, totally right? <laughs> and then if you look and you see, so we can go nice and fine. We can go very, very deep. And then right round and you can see just why these are so brilliant for brush lettering. Which so I love and, and you probably have beautiful penmanship and gorgeous handwriting. I, but, I really don't. But here's the thing, in addition to the eight art liners, yep. you're also going to get the stamps. The, the stamps, which which Take the guesswork out of it well, so you don't have to, to figure it out. This is it. And what I'm going to show you is, um, I'll show you everything in the kit okay. now. I'm going to walk into the demonstration. But if you don't know how to brush letter, the idea is you can stamp mm. and practice the brush strokes that you need and then apply them to your projects. Okay. And then when we're talking about projects, as well as the uppercase and the lowercase stamps, you then get this beautiful pad of designs. Now, these are all hand watercolored by uh, Jennifer Tryon, who's one of the ladies in our team. She comes here regularly to HSN. She has given you... 16 small card blanks, you've got eight full-size pages, 14 half-size pages, and four tall trims in there to work with. So that a lot of these cards that you see that we're working on, all it needs is the brush lettering mm -hmm. to add to, to personalize. Mm -hmm. Personalization is the key. Add your brush lettering onto your own beautiful background. Now, I'm gonna show you exactly how these stamps work, okay? So I've got um, just one of our gray ink pads, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna, so say I wanted to stamp happy okay. right let me get the the letters out so i'll start and build this up and i've got the h already on my um on my work surface so if i just get a piece of clean piece of card we'll use this as the scrap card now and this is the one we'll do now i find you want to ink the stamp up and then actually take off most of the ink okay so if i just stamp that for the first time so we've got it very very light so he's the h uh-huh right then if i put the h back uh, we've got a so I'm just building up the word for me to practice. And you don't necessarily need to stamp this directly on your project. This is literally for you learning the letters. So H, A, uh, two Ps. So we're gonna do Yeah, happy there's two here. Ps and happy. Look how juicy those <laughs> pads are. Uh, so H, A, P, P, and then we're gonna go last in with the Y. So I'm practicing learning how to do happy and just take it one word at a time. So, I mean, you could stamp directly onto your projects if you wanted, but I, I, I like to do it and just, just to learn learn from. Sure. Then you would get your brush pen, so should we do it with um, the yes. nice bright red one? Yes. Yeah? So you take your brush pen and all you're doing is tracing over. So the trick is we're going to go light on the up and then we're gonna come heavy on the down, light on the up, heavy on the down, right? Heavy on the down, light on the up, and then we're going down, 
and so you're just following all I'm doing is following all the It's like the a letters. tracer's guide. You yep. know, it's so simple and easy to do, yet you're getting the results that look as if, you, you know, that those brush strokes that we all desire, that we're seeing in all the Pinterest boards, all the Instagram posts, all the little boutiques and those little pop-up farmer's markets on the Etsy shops. You can design and create your own, even if your own personal handwriting isn't that great. You have these tracer guides that you can use. And then I think once you sort of get the- Once you've practiced- Get the practice of it. Then you're going to do it yourself. Yeah. So it's all about how Having the stamps to learn okay. and then having the pens to give you that professional result. Now, to go and buy br professional brush lettering pens like this, you could be talking thick end of $30 just to get just a pens. decent set of the pens. And you're getting eight pens, all eight different colors eight today. Eight the so different green colors. green and lilac and blue and Plus black. Plus those lovely backgrounds. Mm -hmm. And I think if I just walk you through a lot okay. of those backgrounds, you'll understand what it is. So this is the, the pad basically cut down. So can you see we've got all these little tiny card bases? So you're just using little elements of these to create the front of your cards. Then you could be moving on to the bigger ones. So now we get the half size ones. So this is when you're doing beautiful background cards like these, mm -hmm. right? So you, and this is all, all, all of these are included in right. our pad. And, and honestly, it makes it so easy for you to do. Mm -hmm. And you know, after a while, it might be that you're starting to draw these sorts of designs yourself and you don't need our pad to be able to do this for you. This is giving you the ideas and the backgrounds. But all, all we've tried to do when Jen designed these is give you the basics so, so that say, you have yeah. something to work from. Yeah. And then again, a lot of you I know are going to want to be doing artwork to put up in the home. So you've got some larger pieces in here that you can just add your own brush, brush lettering onto to make you own you know big parts frameable artwork essentially that you can be working with so now you've seen what you've got mm -hmm. now you've seen roughly how to do it let me just take you through again a lot of those samples because I think it all becomes a little bit more meaningful it does it comes alive when, when you, you watch me it. I can do this uh -huh. now so again all we're doing is using the letters and connecting them together in different ways you can go on Pinterest you can put your own bars together you can just go and see how big brush lettering is and once you've got the basics, once you've got this kit, you're going to be able to start. So you're going to be able to learn how to write all of those letters. And then you can personalize them every time. I mean, and I card. see them in people's kitchens and their entryways and their babies' rooms. If you just want something to add that wonderful messaging and the beautiful brush script that you're seeing there, you have the ability to get this Crafters Companion bundle that's going to come with the eight piece pen set. You're going to get the stamp set of all the letters, both lowercase and uppercase you're going to get this large pad to go mm -hmm. with all those watercolor designs that you're seeing for you to really get creative and create your own one-of-a-kind pieces of artwork everything's on five flexible payments eight dollars and 99 cents okay we're gonna give you a little sneak peek on something that's coming up in about 10 minutes <gasps> Oh my gosh, Ooh, I, I cannot wait. wait to see oh, this live. You will love this. Wait, wait till I show you this. Honestly, I mean, look at this technique. This is what you're going to be able to do at home. This is us showing you how Sheena's created the stamps to enable you to then stamp and work with these. But basically, Sheena's our artist. She's done all this work so that then you get this stamp, you stamp it, and you make these sort of finished pieces. And it's going to look just as if Sheena did it because you're yep. giving it step by step everything that you need to know. That's our Sheena Paint Fusion Bundle special birthday price and it's also on five flexible payments as well so we've got lots of things we've got stuff for everyone or maybe everything is for you because I think once you get started you just keep going and building and having so much fun so our next set we're gonna do is gonna be the seven piece border edge die set brand new and save just for you at home right now at this very moment so we have limited quantities on a birthday price what are we gonna get today 12 inch die I personally haven't seen dies this big oh, wow. anywhere ever. Now, you might be looking and thinking, why, why am I going to use 12 inch dies? It was you so big, I, I wasn't even in the shot. I had to move. <laughs> <laughs> so, you could be using these in the edges of, on the edges of your scrapbooks. You could be using them on your cards. I think when I show you the cards that we've made and how we've used these, and these are all designed so that you can thread ribbon through these as well. You can weave into them, you can ink into them. This gives you like a four stitching effect on your cards, this one. Mm -hmm. So, you've got two of the four stitching effects. You've got a couple of the different weaving ones, and then you've just got this beautiful decorative border. 
and all 12 inches over, in length and you're getting the seven piece collection as well which is amazing now if i just show you a lot of these cards then yes you would look at this one up here and say right well that's beautiful but do i really want to make a card this big do i really want to make a card 12 inches long but the thing is if you've got the opportunity to you can use it however you want now that same die has then been used this time on the top of a card so the card's not that big but we've been able to cut oh. all in one go across the edge of the at card a on a diagonal to achieve this sort of look and effect what about your box making and what about doing a box like this one here where we've been able to actually die cut along the side of the border so how professional does that look when the actual sides of our box are die cut in there totally different level now what i loved was this idea here right so if you see this card here here, can you see it's actually being die cut right through the center of the card through the front and the inside this is what you can do with these dies and um, even on the edges of your cards this one here it's just up the edge of the card there and I think it looks really different and, and ornate and unique doesn't it it looks very ornate very expensive very opulent very special unlike anything you're ever going to see you know when you're shopping for typical cards you yep. no, there's nothing typical about this it's always going to be that personalized exceptional result and you can see what we've done is we've done the cut in you've got the stitch effect and you've got the cut out so for example this whole die I mean it's huge right mm -hmm. so what is it working out I put out $30 for all five sets of these and two of the sets have two dies in them mm -hmm. so it's a real ton of dies for you to be working with but this is the sort of effect that you're going to get now just to show you kind of where we would start with this so I've taken a piece of eight and a half by eleven and just literally folded it in half so we've got this really long kind of thin card okay. and I just wanted to show you the extremes of what you could go to if you just to switch does that help you? That would be okay. wonderful. We'll, we'll Thank take you. A switch. So all I'm going to do is going to place this on the edge of my card. Okay. And then I am going to get my little bit of tape and hold this in place. I would recommend get yourself some low tack tape so that you can um, always hold these so they don't move when they're sure. in the machine. Sure. Now I'm using the full size Gemini plates here now. These will fit in other machines. You don't have to use the Gemini with these. I don't want you to feel like our dies are made for this exclusive club of people who own the Gemini. But the Gemini is on the lowest price we've ever done uh, it before so if I know there have been on it. hundreds of people yeah. waiting for this to be back in stock and for you to know that it's coming on that birthday price has been incredible but what I will say is we've sold over a hundred thousand Gemini's now wow. So it's, it's been just over two years, but 100,000 Geminis worldwide. And you go and read about it on any website and you will see it is five star rated yeah. no matter where you go and read about it from. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, this is the product that every die cutter either already owns or aspires to own, right? So if I lift this off now, what you will see is it has cut that into the card and out of the card at the same time. So you get that beautiful border edge up along the edge of your Stunning. card. And then all you do to, to kind of make that into a really spectacular card, if I just show you the one that I've got in, so there's the base card. I've added in a little bit of our glitter card mm -hmm. on the inside. Nothing and wrong with I've a just, little glitter. Oh, I just think it's, it's a bit of pizzazz, doesn't <laughs> yeah. it? It's lovely. Then we've got these on stock on the website, our glitter cards. And I'm just matting and layering up with a little bit of beautiful papers and then just adding a little sentiment. I love how simple it's just a layering process. It's building. It's creating that personal experience. One of a kind opportunities to share with your loved ones, to share with your grandchildren, to give them something that they're going to keep forever. They're going to know yeah. that you built it with love. Love. Yep. Right? Well, now, now you've kind of got the idea. Yes. And you've seen a few of the cards that we can make. If I show you again what the designs are, I want you okay. to be thinking of every one of those cards and how you could be making the cards with the individual designs. So here's the one that I've just been using, and you can see that's the really ornate one. Then you've got this one. Now, I use this for the edges on my boxes quite a lot because it's quite a simple design. This is the one that you saw we had on that card where it would cut it into the center of the card. Now, it doesn't have outside cutting edges, you see, so it's not, it's not cutting a strip we've mm -hmm. put them as a strip to show you but it actually cuts into your card wherever you want it to cut then you've got those lovely stitch edge ones so again all it does is cut the stitching in so if you want to add a stitched effect onto the side of any of your cards you can do that oh she's here with the cards I so am show I, I want to point out that we've taken $50 off of retail for you and five flexible payments $5.99 put that on any major credit yep. card debit card or PayPal this is the uh, saved for you this will sell out we want to make sure that you jump in and take advantage 
advantage of yours. For my life, I've just Let's seen how many people are getting I it. I know. <laughs> I'm pleased you love it. Look at this. Why would you not want to add? I mean, how professional does this card look, Valerie? Yet we were able to cut that yeah. all in one strip. You're probably thinking, why would I ever cut 12 inches? This is a regular size card, yeah. but we've been able to cut all the way down in one go because the board is longer. Here it is with those gorgeous stencils that we had on in the mm -hmm. last presentation, but we've added that border. Now it gives you that four stitch effect as well as the enhancement. This is, oh, I love this one. Let me just come here. These are some embossing folds we've got coming up later. How great does it look adding uh, that stitch on? So that. can you see all it's done, you probably can't even see it there. It's just been stitched extra into the edge of the card. Yeah, look at that, those little so perforated details, out. the little diamond details. Doesn't I look love that. Doesn't it look professional? Then this is, you know, those of you who love our edgeables, who love fancy, ornate, elegant, very over the top, looking spectacular, this is the way to achieve it. There's that same one that we've just used, but down the edge as a wraparound for your card. Now, just because the, the whole die is 12 inches, doesn't mean you need to use all good 12 point. inches. Okay, good. If you've got 12 inches, you could just use three inches sure. on the side of a little card. Sure. But if, if you only had a three inch die, you can't be layering it up umpteen times and making the edge. That is just a recipe for disaster right there. And then look at these. Wow just about creating your own frames. Wow. When you've got border dies, you've got maximum versatility on there. Whether you're doing things like real showstopper cards like this, or whether you're taking it that next level and fully using those 12 inches. I mean, this sort of, it's, it's doing a box edge like this. This is a phenomenal value. Here's what's happening though. We're counting backwards. We will be selling out in this presentation. So if you haven't jumped on the phone lines, I encourage you to do so. $5.99 to secure this to get seven pieces. So you're getting Getting this in the 12 inch length, they're all 12 inches, to give you that intricate detail, those precision cuts that are absolutely astounding, gives it such oh. an ornate, you such an expensive if that, look. If that was a wedding card, oh, this is the one that I keep coming back to. How I love this super one. clever is this? I'm, and I'm saying it again, total another Pinterestable, yeah. Instagrammable yeah. one. How awesome is that card? What a unique and different way. And that's because that die, when you lie it mm. in the card, it doesn't mm -hmm. have an edge, a cutting edge. So you put it in and it cuts into your card. It doesn't actually cut anything out. Our and producer Paul just said it's la it looks like lattice work. It does, doesn't it? Well, Paul. Oh, and, then, and then you could stencil through it with your ink oh, pads. You oh, yes. Now we're, talk now we're talking. Now we're talking. Jump on the phone lines. We'll let you know when this is all spoken for, but I want to make sure that you stay in the ordering process so we can count your order in. Brand new, congratulations to all of you that have picked this up. We're gonna take a little chintzy break, a little small break, so that we can uh, process all your orders for this set. But don't go anywhere because Sarah and I have just a few more surprises for you right after this. Discover the newest way to create a style all your own. The HSN Style Edit. A curated look at the season's best, most original finds for every part of your life. We decode the trends, share tips and how-tos, and give you the inspiration you need to style it your way. It's the joy of the hunt and the thrill of the find. Your unique style is here. Discover it now, exclusively at hsn.com. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. So right. this is Sheena. Uh -huh. Sheena actually came out with me in March when we launched this concept. Sheena is our on-staff artist. So uh -huh. she is the clever lady who comes up with ideas to make art accessible to crafters. That's the whole reason I brought Sheena on in the first place, because I'm a crafter. I am about as far removed from an artist as what you can get. Mm. However, 
I want that look. Exactly. I want to do it. And what Shane does is makes it easy. So for example, this technique, it's an age old technique of folk painting. It's been around for years and years, long before we were born. And many people have developed different ways to show you how to do it. Shane's way of developing and teaching you how to do this painting is, as you saw in the little video a little while back, is to take a, a, a painting, to paint something like this future, future, decompose it, draw around it, create a stamp set, so that you can then stamp and then paint. And we've got a nice little video to show you, actually, where you can see how you start off by stamping. Mm -hmm. So you can see this is just coming away. This is the sweet pea one that we're going to use here. And we're going to start off stamping. So you stamp your own composition. Then what you do is you double load up your brush. These practice sheets come included. So you first of all paint onto the practice sheet until okay. you get the hang of it. You're mixing your colours. You've got the DVD with Sheena over three hours where she teaches you every different type of technique and then you start and build these up. Now in the starter kit, you are going to get, you've got two options of starter kits. One starter kit is going to teach you to do the fuchsia, the lilac and also the rose. And then if you missed it in March, we've brought it back again where you can get the other kit which is going to allow you to do the sweet pea. Okay. Also the daisy. How gorgeous is the daisies? And then, oh look, I'm gonna show you it in the other color as well. How great do the daisies look? And then also the beautiful uh, rose blossom that has the butterfly in with it. So you're gonna be able to paint butterfly. the rose bottom and the butterfly. Now, if I take you over and show you exactly what's in the kit, yes. hopefully look, it will make so sense. Because there's so much in this kit, Sarah. Well, let's, so should we start with the one up here? So this okay. is the brand new one that just launched this morning, right? So you get those three sets of stamps. So as you saw Sheena work it out, you stamp your uh -huh. own composition. Then you're going to take your paint, so you get seven colors of the paint, and you're going to load up your brush. You get the three brushes included. You're going to watch her DVD, which is up here, and then you're going to practice on the practice sheets. So all of this, so that you can learn, you can enhance, you've got the paints, you've got the brushes, you've got the stamps to keep doing it over and over again, all of that in the one starter kit. And then if you miss the one that we had in March, this is the one that started in March. Now I'm going to just go straight in to do a little bit of stamping and, and a little bit of painting. You'll be able to watch and follow what I'm doing. Okay, while you're watching, Sarah, we do have a phone caller waiting to chime in and hang out with hey. us. So good morning, Sheila from Georgia. You're live in the air. I'd love to introduce you to Sarah Davies and I'm Valerie. Hi. Hi, uh, Sheila. I, hello. I just want you to know I've been up since 11 o'clock. <laughs> oh, but Sheila, uh -huh. I think that was what constitutes being called a super fan. Yes, and yes. I have everything. <laughs> <laughs> what, are you, what are you picking up today? I think you got the die set that we just showcased? Yes, I got the die set. Um, I already have Sheena's um, flowers and butterfly, mm -hmm. um, you know, the... The pin fusion the here. One, two, three. Yeah, oh, oh, yes, the, um, the... The ink pad set. The stencils, the stencils. Yes. yes. Wonderful. Yes, and I've ordered everything that you put on at um, 1 o'clock or 12 o'clock last night. So yep. I've been up ordering everything. Good for you, <laughs> Sheila. Do you know you are going to have so much fun, Sheila. Yes, and I'm a school teacher, so I will take that to my classroom. Oh, wonderful. I oh, love that you're wonderful. sharing that with the next generation, Sheila. Hopefully you're taking advantage of our flat $5 shipping rate and all our flex pay. We're doing five flexible payments today on all our crafting. This is our big 41st birthday, and we are celebrating in a big way. This, my friend, So I've just done the leaf. Stunning. So you watch me do the leaf. Let me show you then how we can move on and do the rows. Okay. Right? Now, this is all about how those stamp sets work. So okay. if I bring in the uh, the actual rows. Now, can you see it's in multiple parts? Uh -huh. So what I'm doing is I'm starting off positioning that rows down. And what I'm going to do, I'm doing it on the black card just so that the camera can pick it up a little bit easier. Right? I'm going to pick up, I'm just going to use the white paint essentially as an ink pad. Right? Okay. So I'm just stamping in white so that you can see where, so I'm, where can. I'm going. So I've put that white paint on here and I'm going to start off by then painting. So we're going to paint into this. Now, are and, you ready? And I know you're using the cardstock, but can we do this on like tile or wood or any type of furniture finishes? Or onto glass oh, darling. Wow. Or if we want to create our own uh, finished little oh, pieces like this. Or what about if you want to do it onto slate? <gasps> Every How one of these. Pretty. I'm just showing you on paper. Okay. You would never do this All right. with everything you can do. We only have a couple minutes. We're going to watch Sarah as she makes this flower come nice. to life. We've got Nancy from Pennsylvania joining us. Nancy, good morning. You're live on the air with Sarah and Valerie. Good morning. 
Good morning, Nancy. Hey, have you tried the pin fusion, Nancy? I haven't done, uh, no, I uh, got the border dyes. I'm anxious to get them. Oh, fantastic. Hey, actually, you've done really well because it looked like they were on their way to selling out. Oh, good. <laughs> You're going to love them. The thing is, have you got a Gemini, Valerie? I have a Gemini Junior. The Junior, brilliant. The thing is, if when, when you've got the pressure in that Gemini, you want to be able to really use it to best advantage. And I think, you know, having these dies, it's like investing in tools. It's like investing in, a, in your own paper trimmer every time. So once you've got that machine, you really want to get the most from it by getting the extra dies. Oh, that's for sure. I'm starting to have a room that's going to be Crafter Companion. I oh, love yay. it. You'll have to send me a picture. Are you on Facebook there? Are you on Facebook, I Nancy? I am. <gasps> Wonderful. Yes, yeah, send that over to Sarah. Um, and, the, and the dice that you picked up, Nancy, completely all spoken for. So congratulations. I'm glad that you were able to secure yours. Thanks for giving us a call. Um, can you talk to us real quick, Sarah, about what you're doing? Oh, yeah, because all I'm doing. You were talking and doing this all at the same time. I know, but the thing is, it's, it's because it's that easy to do remember sheen is coming home on the dvd with you okay so all i'm doing is i'm doing the little wiggly brush strokes that she teaches you on the dvd but i'm doing them into the stamp so i would never be able to stamp without that but i've done them into the stamp now that gets you the first part of the rose and actually that's quite a pretty it flower it looks beautiful but we want it to look like an actual rose so let me okay. show you what the rose looks like when it's finished oh, wow. and you see this is just the outer part Right? So then what you're going to do is you're then going to start and stamp the next piece on the inner part. So if I take this bit of the stamp off, I put the next bit of the stamp in. We're going to, again, if I just paint around the outside, um, and I'm going to stamp into the centre. Now, usually, if I'm being honest, Valerie, you would wait till these are dried mm -hmm. before you go and stamp. But, I'm, but we're, we're live on TV, and there's a lot that I want to show you, right? So I'm just cleaning off the brush, and I'm starting again. Watch this. You've got to watch over here. This is the technique. So on your brush, this is what you learn on the DVD. You scoop up one colour, you scoop up the other colour, and then you mix them together in front of you. And what it does is it pushes the paint up the brush. So we're going to do this three times. Scoop, scoop and then merge it together and push it up the brush. Scoop, scoop, push it up the brush. Then I'm gonna go over where I stamped. Now if I had to stamp, if I had to do this rows without having the stamp to work in, I would find that pretty much impossible. Yeah. But having the stamp element, so now all I'm doing is I'm following the bit that Sheen has stamped for me. And this is why it's called paint fusion, because it's a fusion of that traditional four cart painting technique. And Sheena's way of bringing that to life is making it accessible for people with stamps. So loads of other people have brought you different ways to do this, but she's enabled you to do it by having the stamp to stamp into. And then all you're doing is creating that element. I love this. So therapeutic. It creates go. that beautiful professional painting, that folk art. And Sheena's going to come directly home with you because she's giving you an instructional DVD. All of the paint, all of the paint brushes, and the stamps are all included. All you have to choose is whether you want the butterfly floral or the country garden. This is a huge customer pick with a 4.3 rating. So you can read um, some of your fellow crafters' uh, reviews on that, but secure yours for five, uh, seven dollars and 99 cents as part of our big birthday crafting extravaganza that is our fun way we that we could have used a lot more time on that oh, I, we I could have spent so ages. many people but on this the is line. the sort of thing don't worry because actually you're going to watch the dvd right you know me having eight minutes to show you is nothing compared to sheena coming in and your lounge and teaching you for three hours and you can start and stop sheena on your dvd <laughs> exactly okay so we've got one more item with sarah this is the crafters companions stamp and die set under $20 bill five flexible payments $3.99 this is all for that fan this is the fancy stuff oh, right this, this is, is if you want to create your own 3D wow. flowers so you've seen us painting a fuchsia mm -hmm. now we're going to actually make a 3D fuchsia I mean come on folks how incredible do they they actually look lifelike there's no and they are way. made out of paper that looks like dried flowers do you know they, and these are these are done by Sheena again wow. so what Sheena's done here okay. and what you need to understand is if I show, I show you this fuchsia right we all want to be able to make this but it's very very difficult to do not that difficult actually I'm going to do it for you in a couple of minutes <laughs> however if I just take you over to what you're getting in here Sheena has designed stamps okay. and dies so you what you do is you stamp all of the individual components okay and then you die cut over the stamp pieces so this is the stamp set and eight the die set sorry each one of the dies die cuts over the stamped elements 
and then I'm going to show you how that all comes together to make the fuchsia. To this is what I'm going to show that. you live. That's the fuchsia. Now okay. you're going to choose between either the fuchsia okay. or the lilac. And I know there was a bit of an argument early on which one was going to be most popular. I love the creation of the fuchsia. I know the lilac is one of the most popular flowers. They're selling evenly because many of them are picking one of oh, each. You've got to have them. You have to. Under $20 yeah. to be able to stamp and die. And then again, look at this. This is the finished lilac. Would you really want to sit and, and, and cut all of this out by hand? No. You would pay the $19.95 just for the die set in here. So see it as the stamps are kind of coming as a bit of a bonus, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Now... I'm going to have to kind of fast forward a few okay. little bits here because I, I, I want to show you how I to create you to run out this. Of time. Right. So what I've done is I've already stamped and I've already die cut the pieces, right? So people have seen me stamp and die cut. So you stamp the piece and then you lie the die over and it die cuts it out. So these are all the component pieces in your fuchsia. So what I'm going to do is show you how it all comes together. So this is the center piece. We start in the middle and then we're just going to roll this round in our fingers. You imagine if you'd cut these pieces out. I mean, that would just be so destroying, Valerie, wouldn't it? Just mm -hmm. sit and cut all these. So there is the center piece of our fuchsia. That is going to go inside this part here so all I'm doing is shaping this and you don't need special tools you know as some people have flower shaping tools and I've worked with them before at home but for me I quite often just want to be if I can't shape it with my fingers I don't want to I don't want to do it so there's the outside piece of my fuchsia I'm just going to take a hot glue gun I don't use a hot glue gun very often but it's because I wanted this to stick instantly so that I could show you live on air how well this comes together so I'm going to stick the center part of my fuchsia around that part there right okay, so there's yeah. the center part so now we'll let that hot glue gun dry and i'll put that to one side we'll make the next part of the fuchsia do you want to just hold that yeah it dries more thank happy you to. Yep. so the next part is the end piece so if you just remember what we're working towards we've just made this first piece here now we're going to make the back piece so all you do, start with the center part. So again, this has been stamped and die cut for you. And then you're just rolling it into a cone in, in your fingers, right? Very, very easy to do. So we've created that cone effect. And then the cone, again, is going to shape around the petals. And you don't have to do, oh. Here we go. You, you you pay more attention than what I'm doing <laughs> live on air. I know this you're trying to rush. One. Well, you're trying to rush I'm because nearly 1,200 of these have been right? spoken for. Oh. Um, remember, you have your choice of the fuchsia or of the lilac. Many of you are picking up both. It's really simple and easy, but the fuchsia that you're doing, okay, now everybody's picking up extra the fuchsia. fuchsia. Yeah. I knew the fuchsia would yeah. be busy, right? So here we go. Actually, I've stuck that on the wrong side. That's going to come into the base. So this comes on the inside piece here. Uh, and I am doing this with a hot melt glue gun, so you, I want you to be impressed there that I'm not burning myself. <laughs> or I am burning myself and I'm covering it up really well. And then these two parts here stick together. Oh, wow. So can you see how that yes. fuchsia has come together in front of your eyes, right? And then all we're going to do is take the leaves. So the even leaves. the leaves are included in the set. So even if you aren't using these with a fuchsia, the leaves will be incredibly handy. And again, they just shape in front of your fingers. And then when you're doing beautiful cards like like this, all you're going to do is put a few little blobs of, of glue down again. We're going to pop these together and we're going to create like a bit of a, a bit of a scene really. And then our lovely fuchsia is just going to lie. Don't tell on my there. husband, but I think I'd rather have flowers that last forever because these are things that you'll keep out. They're a talking point, oh. they're so special, and I love that they're three-dimensional. Oh how stunning. And honestly, I know I'd already stamped and die cut it, but you watched me create that live on air in two minutes. Two minutes. Two minutes to do that live on air. Now, the fuchsia, you imagine doing that then. I know fuchsia stamps are really popular. We've, we've had the fuchsia stencils in this show. Yep. We've had the fuchsia stamps. Now, you've got creating your own 3D fuchsias. I mean, this, a, a spray of fuchsias like this. But, follow if you had to go into the shop and buy these flowers, mm -hmm. you could be paying six, seven dollars just for the flowers. Just for the flowers, I'm yeah. giving you the tool to do these flowers over and over and over again in any different colour. So look how different they look when you do them in the nice pale colours. And the fuchsia is just the first one. Remember, there is two of these in the set. So you're getting the fuchsia, 
but then also I want to come and show you the lilac because the lilac is just as beautiful. Yeah, we've got to give the way. lilac some love and attention as well. It's got to get in um, there. I do want to encourage everyone to use express automated ordering. We're doing five flexible payments on all of our crafting, which means this set that you're getting today is $3.99. You choose either the lilac, which we're going to showcase now, or the fuchsia, which is available to you as well. This is brand new. Um, and it is, oh, it's all about it the fancy little delicate details. Look at this. Now, the lilac stamp is a beautiful stamp in and of its own. But then to have the die cut, so to be able to die cut around all of this, to take the detail out, to have the matching leaf and then the accessory pieces, is just stunning. So what I've done is, okay. I've die cut and then I've used my sparkle pens just to add a little bit of color over top mm -hmm. of here. So that's going to lie on the front of the card. Now you also get this little set of dies. So I've die cut loads of little tiny buds of lilac and I've just made them sticky. So now if we put these on here, you see, oh, look at it makes it a little bit more three-dimensional. Totally. So all these are included there. So obviously you would do, you would be taking your time at home. I'm just giving you the but idea. But you know what you're saying, you, taking your time, whether you have the time or not, or not yeah. look at the result. The result is absolutely stunning, spectacular, one of a kind. When you see this come to life, you just know that the person you're gonna give this to, imagine their smile, imagine their oh. emotion, imagine how special they feel to receive something like this from you. And it's such a small investment, $3 and change to get it oh, home. Get it home and try it. Wow. <gasps> and I mean, look, here, we'll show them side by side. Oh. So the fuchsia is the one that I'm holding. And oh, then you've, you've got, got the lilac. Both. Yeah, you've if you can. You've got to look at that. I mean, less, about $8 to bring them yep. home, Sarah. Sarah, yep. it's been delightful to spend the hour with you. Thank Be you so wonderful. very much. Thank you so very much for shopping with me over the last three hours. But don't go anywhere because Bobby Ray is coming up next. And she's going to talk about the Today's Special and, with Anna Griffin. Well, and I'll be on Facebook, oh. remember, on the HSN page in 20 minutes. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good crafting day. Ha, ha, ha.